The Angolan ambassador to Nigeria, Evaristo Domingos, said illegal arm dealers took advantage of the conflict that devastated his country to engage in their illicit trade, and the watchful eyes of the Angolan government ensured that they are apprehended and prosecuted, as in the case of Henry Hogger. Evaristo Domingos said his country's experience during its 14 years of war against colonialism and almost 30 years of civil war has made it sensitive to helping out in conflict situations as it did in the Democratic Republic of Congo. And as a member of the African Union, AU, Angola is committed to protecting democratically elected governments in Africa. Speaking briefly in English, the Angolan ambassador said his country is recovering slowly but consistently from the effect of the civil war and huge reconstruction projects aimed at improving the living standard of Angolans are going on all over the country. Angola was found itself in a new stage of development since peace was established on April of 2002. During these six years of peace, the country has re reconstructed much of the schools and medical centers that were destroyed during the colonial war and internal conflict. For six years on, Angola has enjoyed relative peace, which has allowed for the election of President Eduardo dos Santos's government in September 2000. There is Oladi Banjo for AIT News.